Hi, I'm Rich Swift from Algonquin Outfitters here at Oxtongue Lake on the west boundary of Algonquin Park. And I'm here today to talk about what to bring to have a safe and fun wilderness canoe trip. Proper gear is essential if you're going to be on a multi-day canoe trip in the wilderness. Your gear is often the one thing that can make it or break your experience. Your tent, cook gear, all your food, and your canoe. You really rely on no matter what the weather. What we have in front of you is everything you would need to take a three-day, two-person wilderness canoe trip. Here, you have all the essentials from your sleeping bags, thermal rest, your tent, a fly, all your cook gear, grills, your first aid kit, and of course, your toilet paper. Once you know what you're taking on a trip, you need to know what to put it in. And two of the packs that we use in our system are the barrel pack and are the traditional canoe pack. Now the barrel pack is a little more rigid. It is small critter proof. We always really recommend hanging the, a barrel or a canoe pack no matter what at night with your food items in it. But it also is more waterproof. The traditional canoe pack can dispute the weight more in the pack and does traditionally hold more gear. Traditionally in a barrel, what you do is you pack in layers. You have your last day's worth of food rations on the bottom and you stack it up on the day. So when you reach in, you're gathering your food for that particular day. And all the squishable items you can put in there like bread and eggs. So it's really a very useful system. In a traditional canoe pack, we usually put softer items towards the back. Then we usually put medium weight items on the bottom, heavier items in the middle, and the lighter items on the top. So you're distributing the weight properly and it's easier to carry. Your gear is the most important thing you need on a canoe trip. From the canoe itself to the sleeping pad you rest on, they are all critical for an enjoyable, comfortable excursion. Rental and all items like these are inexpensive to rent nowadays, so gear up, go outside and have a great adventure.